Hi everyone, this is Space Toad and welcome to this new Billcraft video. Today we are going to show a preview of Billcraft 6.1, which uh, is the new branch in development and in particular will provide those uh, robots features. Uh, let's get started. So you can tell that on my hand, uh, at the bottom here, I've got um, one picker robot that we've seen already uh, in the previous video. But I've got this new blue robot as well, which is a lumberjack robot. Uh, the idea in the new Billcraft 6.1 nomenclature is that all robots related to factory functions will be blue. Um, so obviously a, a robot that provides uh, wood is considered to be part of the factory cycle. Anyway, uh, I'm going to place this robot on this station here and the first thing it does is to look for another station that will provide power. So that's one of the new mechanics that is now implemented in uh, the development version of Billcraft 6.1. Robot, they will consume power and uh, they will look for stations, they will look for pod connected to these pipes uh, to, to get it. Now, my robot is filled with power and it's actually going to look for this station here next to this chest. The reason is that this chest contains axes and obviously the robot needs an axe uh, to cut wood. So now that it has the axe, so you can see that it looked for wood and it's starting to cut the wood. Now this is roughly the mechanics of uh, the lumberjack robot. It's going to uh, cut wood as long as it has a, a working axe, it's going to go fetch energy if it's out of power and it's going to uh, go fetch new axes uh, when the one that is using um, is too damaged and breaks. Now you may notice that uh, although the robot does cut wood, it does not pick any of the items that uh, gets thrown away, so for that obviously you will need the picker robot. So just uh, for completion, I'm going to place two of those guys here. And as you can see, uh, they start to operate like the uh, lumberjack robots. The first thing that they need to do is to extract power. So they are um, fueling themselves right now. Um, that may take a bit longer than the previous one because uh, obviously there's two, so there's uh, half as much power for each of them. Anyway, we can uh, carry on, verify that the uh, lumberjack robot is working properly while those two guys are filling. Uh, you can tell that the uh, pathfinding algorithm are, are working quite well at this stage. Anyway, okay, so those two robots, they are on their way already and they work a bit better than the ones in the previous video. Uh, now they know how to find the closest uh, item and they won't go looking very far on the map if there are items to be picked um, nearby. And, uh, okay, you can tell that they're just going to follow the trail of item that has been uh, generated behind that uh, lumberjack robot. So using those features you could create almost a, a self-contained system um, using the wood to partially power some engines to provide a, a power to the system and then using some other pieces of the wood to uh, create axes to replace those that are being uh, used. The only piece that would be missing here is a robot to put saplings back in order to grow new trees. Uh, as you might expect, this is uh, on the roadmap as well. Actually, there is a lot more. There are a lot more of robot kinds that are under development. But uh, for now, uh, that's it. So this was a preview of Billcraft 6.1, which is currently under development. Thanks a lot for having watched the video. I hope to talk to you soon. Bye-bye.